And what really drove me sort of, I think, ultimately to become where I am a behavioral economist today was the work of Al Roth and the work of people that were saying this isn't an abstract theoretical idea, that these things could really matter a lot. And in particular, there was a series of work that Al Roth did at the time, um, eventually wins a Nobel Prize for this. I think it was very inspirational to many young economists of the day. Um, and the idea being where, um, where, where markets could, could really fail based on really small uh, sort of rules that could be changed quite easily, and then they could su succeed quite dramatically. And he demonstrated this uh, in labor markets. He did this within one particular program, what's called the National Residency Program. And what we found was, and what he found was that um, these really small differences in the way students were being assigned could be the difference between terrible matches where students' lives would be dramatically affected and get placed into the wrong programs and the wrong specialties to programs that worked really quite beautifully. And you really got the right match between the needs of the hospital and the needs of the patients to get the right outcome. And that was very inspirational, I think, for me, thinking about the role of economics to really solve practical problems. And I think that's sort of led me to where I am today as a behavioral economist.